Welcome everyone to This Is Not A Drill by KSI Milkman and Skull of Death, a great racetrack that takes difficult racing, roller coaster racing, and puts it together with aesthetics to create a beautiful racetrack that is just so much fun to race on and look at at the same time. My favorite part of this track is how they put together two very separate products to create an even better one. This is a great racetrack in itself with a bunch of different areas that you have to go over the different jumps and you have to do these at full speed or else you will not make it, making it difficult, which I very much enjoy. Challenges in racetracks are something that I enjoy quite a bit. But not only that, he's even got a stunt in this that he likes to call the jet stall that goes with the theme, that when you go over it, you have to quickly fix your camera because your character, your mongoose, will go up and he'll do a backflip and it'll do it in a way that a plane would when they would go upward and just point straight upward to fly and then stall. He calls it the jet stall stun and it very much fits that name. Along with that is the aesthetics of this track which were created mostly by Skull of Death. He did a very good job creating one, the army base that you'll see below, the missile launcher along the, this track, and also a lot of the planes here. Now one of the planes was created by KSI Milkman but the effort that went into the aesthetics is definitely notable. There is so much to see on this track, and it, once you go into Forge and check it out, or you check it out in theater, or you just slow down a bit and maybe you'll fall off the track, but get a better look at these planes, you'll see how much detail there is in them. There's even fire coming out of the back of a lot of them. There's one taking off over in the military base. All of this is just so impressive. It's all together a very beautiful track to look at. Now when it comes to the difficulty of this, this is something that you will actually have to take quite a while to finish. Even though this is a short track, that will only take you about a minute to complete a lap if successful, it's actually quite difficult to do that. Me playing on this, it took me about 15 minutes to complete my very first lap. And that's because the jet stall stun actually takes quite a bit of practice if you don't know what you're doing. What was noted by KSI Milkman is to go over that, what you need to do is fix your camera more than anything else. When you go over it, you'll notice that your camera will be pointing at the air, and you need to try and fix it as fast as possible to be pointing down at the track in front of you, even if your mongoose is still a little sideways. If you don't do that, you will for sure fall. So fix your camera, and you will be able to make it. In this gameplay, you can see exactly how I do that, so I recommend just looking at that if you need some tips on how to do it. This track is so much fun to play on, it's difficult, and the aesthetics are just beautiful. If you want a track that just has all those things put together and you'd like to try something that challenges your racing skills, I highly recommend this. If you guys would like to see more videos, don't forget to check out my other ones in the sidebar, subscribe for more Halo 5 content, and comment if you have anything to say about this. Really, uh, that's all I have to say here, so I will see you guys later. Have a great day.